Good morning, everybody. Tyler from Team Coffee. And, well, it's gonna be a fun day today. Going fishing today. It's about five in the morning right now. I'm heading up to Vega today. It's about an hour and a half from where I live. I'm picking up my buddy, Jeremy Tanner. Last time, as you guys know, we went fishing and he got skunked. We had a really rough day at Lake Rio Blanco. So today, hoping for a little bit of redemption. He's 20 minutes from where I live. So I'm gonna go grab him, he's on the way. And then we'll be up there, hopefully by a little after sunrise or right at sunrise. So stay tuned guys, I'm gonna be picking him up in just a second. So we're here to pick up Coach Tanner right now. I'm feeling pretty excited to get some yeah, fish. Yeah, let's go crush some fish. Let's do it. We're about to head up there right now guys, so see you soon. All right, we made it. So you guys probably saw earlier, I was just kind of in a hoodie and stuff like that. It was only 15 degrees earlier this morning. And we're up here at uh, Vega right now. It's uh, a couple thousand more feet up, but it's supposed to be a pretty nice day today. Um, right now, what, it's probably about 16, 17 degrees up here. Sorry, I had to take my face mask down, guys. But the town closest to this reservoir, it's uh, the high today is gonna be 38 degrees. So it's probably gonna be in the mid 30s, low 30s up here today. And it's gonna be sunny the whole time. I wish it was that type of temperature and a little bit of overcast, but we'll take what we can get. It's gonna be a beautiful day. So let's stop talking. Let's get out there and get some fish. Holes are drilled. Got my three holes here. One here for the transducer, one for me, one for my secondary pole right over there. Secondary pole gonna be throwing a little tube jig squid here nothing crazy it's gonna have that sitting on the bottom maybe right off of it Sam was getting some good luck with that here last time already marking some fish so that's good marked a couple fish some at 16 a couple at 10 we're gonna drop this tube squid down here right now we're going for as many catches as we can get me and coach Tanner we're up here for most of the day, we got basketball practice later. So we gotta get back there for that. Oop. Got one. Little bow. Find the jig off, tube jig off the bottom. It's a good start. Let's get him back in. Nice, Tanner's on. Decent nice bow. One. Nice one. Yeah, man. HD, dynamic lures. Dude, that's a really nice one. Good stuff. Awesome. Yeah. Sweet, Tanner's got the skunk out. Redemption already. <laughs> oh, got one. Double fisting. That's a decent one. All right, guys, quality bow. Nice, dude. Nice, solid 15, right under 15. About 15 and a half, you stretch the fin, yeah. Sweet, man. Double ups. Sweet. Let's get him back in. Me and Tanner, been here for about, oh. Got one. Second double up. We've been here about 30 minutes, guys. Oh, I think this is a cut bow. Yep, guys, this is a cut bow. See the slash there? Awesome. We'll the white tips. You can tell that color's just a little different. You guys have seen a lot of the bows I catch. Trout look different depending on the habitat they're in, what they're eating and stuff like that, time of year. But yeah, these, these cut bows just look a little bit different. Yeah. Good yeah, stuff, man, dude. You're just, we are just crushing it right now. <laughs> this is insane. Woo. Let's go. Slow down here. Glad I got to get Tanner up here to get some fish, considering that the last time I took him fishing, we had some tough luck. Not to be spoken of. Not to be spoken of. Oh. Got one. Dude, they're crushing this jig on just dead sticking it. I think that's another cut bow. Oh shoot, I think he inhaled it. Oh, never mind. There's another pretty cut bow. Another slash there, you can barely tell. I had him out for a minute already, so I'm gonna get him back in. See you, buddy. That hook came out a lot easier than I thought it would, so that's nice. So guys, nothing special. Just got the Berkeley tube jig on here, and they're just crushing it. Yes, dude. Nice, Tanner over here killing it. Yeah, little guy. 
<laughs> Dude, it's so warm. I haven't even worn my gloves. I've just been sticking my hands in the water. <laughs> so I'm gonna be throwing this now. Been field testing this for my sponsor, Pete's Custom Trout Worms. Two inch paddle tail swim bait. Hooked up on a 1 16th ounce old Ned rig head here, ball head, and fire tiger pattern. Oh, Jesus. Jeez, this thing's fighting hard. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Pete. Dude, I was bouncing at 10. That thing gunned it right off the bottom so fast and just nailed it. Solid thick 14 and a quarter, guys. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful fish. Sort of reminds me of the dynamic lures. Little swim jig that they have, little paddle tail. Except for this one, comes in a lot more wide variety of colors. Loving it though. You got a big one? Oh, on your transducer? Yeah, that'll happen. Got a decent guy. Put him back. There's bigger out there. I'm getting mad hits. I think that's one thing that after using this, these swim baits for three times now, these definitely work and they definitely get hits. I just gotta stop sucking and land these fish. And I got all kinds of stuff if you wanna try other stuff. Yeah, I'm field test. Got one. No! That is insane. There we go. I hook set that one. Oh my god, I got another one coming. Shoot. Oh, that's a big one too. Oh, okay, that one's off. I had my other pole was getting hit as I was pulling that one in. Look at that. Fire tiger. Getting it done. Oh, a little over 15, guys. Again, off and on field testing this stuff for my sponsor. This stuff works great, though. I'm hitting him up as soon as I get home today and being like, dude, this stuff, this stuff works. I haven't hit him up since he sent these to me. I've caught a fish out the bubblegum pink, got a lot of traction at the Grand Mesa video with the fire tiger. Pulling a lot in with the fire tiger right now. Well, not pulling a lot in, pulled in two, but getting hits <laughs> left and right. Tanner's gonna try in the bubblegum one right now. So the hook goes out the bottom right here? Up the top, so then the paddle tail bottom is facing down. Right. So then, yeah. So the hook. Yeah, yeah, so. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tanner's gonna be testing those out too. Let's see, let's see if we can pull in some more with them here. Got it. <sighs> he was thinking about it for a while. Oh yeah. Pete's custom trout worms, let's go. Put it in work. Go. <laughs> yeah, up here. There we go. Stay on, stay on. Nice. Oh. It's a fish, I guess. Out of all the fish down there, this is the one that takes it. This little guy, Pete's custom, doing the work. Oh, shoot. Oh, he's coming back. Got it. Oh no. Dude, he came right back for it. He gunned it so hard and nailed it. Got one too. Double up. Mine's smaller. Oh no, it's actually decent. I'm gonna fight out. Yeah, Pete. 16 is all good, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, Fire Tiger swim bait. Pete's custom. Got it. Oh, that's a good one. They're all good ones, I guess. Not a very long guy, but a real thick guy. Look at where his head is. Look at the shoulders on him. Look at that guy's slash. Got the slash there, more cup bow action. Cup bows and rainbows all day. It's mid-morning right now. It's about 10 o'clock, a little after 10. Just checking in with you guys. It has been a phenomenal morning. We are just over here in this corner spot. Got it all to ourselves. Lake's got a little bit more crowded as the day has gone on, but not much, you know, you can't. It's a big lake and there's probably one, two, three, four, five, seven other parties here. Yeah, cut bows, rainbows, everything we've caught has been pretty girthy. Um, everything been about 14 to 16. Was that small one you got? Was that probably a little bit shorter? 
Yeah, he has maybe 10. Yeah, so maybe out of all the fish we've caught, we've caught one that's under 14 inches so far. So it has been great. I'll stop talking, we'll get back to fishing. Down from the little progress we put there, guys, and walk away and Tanner pulls in another one. We haven't been keeping track, guys, but we've been catching a lot of fish. Tanner just pulling in more fish. I think uh, they passed the field test. Seriously. <laughs> I think anything Fire Tiger from his company passes the field test. <laughs> Hitting the redemption hard this time. I guess so. Oh, got one. Oh, shoot, he came off. Oh, got something looking. Look how pink his gills are. Oh, got one. <laughs> come back, come back, come back. Oh, that's a decent one. Oh, that's a really decent one. Holy crap. At least it looks like you guys. <laughs> oh, shoot. I think it's on my transducer now. Oh, my gosh, guys. Oh, my gosh, guys. Oh, my gosh, guys. Oh. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> oh my god! Please tell me I'm recording. Yes! <laughs> yeah, you got it. Pete the fire tiger. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. That is huge. <laughs> oh, 19. 19 inches, guys. 19 inch. I think that's a flat bow. Yep. 19 inch rainbow, guys. Happy about that. <laughs> I'm so pumped. Yeah. This is my first big in through the ice this year. Really nice 19 inch girthy rainbow. Let him go make more big Yeah, let's go make, yeah. Get to be a master angler soon, buddy. There he goes. Yes! <laughs> yes! 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 So pumped. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'm going to talk really briefly again. If this isn't, a, if that wasn't a selling point for you to get some of these, I don't know what is. Got one. No! <laughs> Got it. Is that another good one? Shoot, he's all tangled up in my transducer. Yeah, he's still fighting. Oh God. Oh, your line is all jacked. Yep. And my reel's breaking as we speak. Oh, okay. it's on my other line. Yep. Oh, okay. Makes more sense. Another Ooh. double up. More double ups. That's five. Yeah, Just a five, little guy. Five double ups, Minus guys, food. so far. Right? I can munch that guy. <laughs> <laughs> this one's a really pretty one. Yeah. You got line on you. Or does he shoot? It's right there. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, guys, I was messing with this other camera trying to get it going here. And uh, had a fish on me here. Yeah, that's a good one. See, look at that, guys. I was trying to get my batteries and stuff going on this other one here. I looked up on my fish finder and I saw a giant blip checking out my lure. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Tanner's still throwing the fire tiger or swim bait. It's been working really well for me, too, but I'm just going to switch it up for the heck of it. I'm going to go with the Titan Tungsten now with a couple of wax worms on here. Just seeing if we can catch stuff with a wide variety of stuff today. Got one. Titan tungsten guys. Let's keep them on though so we can. Oh geez, that's a good one. Jeez. Ah, nice and girthy. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be a good one. He's just real girthy. He's been lifting weights. Seriously, he's been in shoulder presses. <laughs> Look at this guy, dude. He's been doing shoulder presses. The tank. Look at the girth on this. Look at what? Look at that girth on the top. That's insane. Yeah, about 14 inches. Just really girthy, really pretty. No. Oh, the catch though. The football catch. Yeah, turn around. There you go. Got it. 
Nice, really tiny slash. Either way, beautiful fish. Dunks. Because I was changing my battery out of my GoPro here and I just had my HDI just sitting there dead sticked in the water and this fish came up. I jigged it once and he nailed it. Little stalker bow, let's get him back in. I don't even have my case on this right now. I'm just holding it, that's funny. Here's my head. Here's my head case. I was really just trying to switch this out real quick and this fish came up and just crushed it. Got one. Oh God. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. I've got a fish on every setup that I brought today. I guess dead sticking was the way to go there. Nice, that's a good one. Gorgeous rainbow guys. Still got some of my waxies in his mouth, but let him keep those uh, for lunch. There he goes. Got it. No, he came off. Oh no, I have him still. Shoot. Nice. Yeah, dude. Sixth double up today for me and Coach Tanner. <laughs> His is much bigger this time. <laughs> we've been we've been switching off. Some have been about the same size. It's been that type of day though. But we're gonna get these fish put back in, guys, and we'll be right back with you. Whoo! What a great morning, guys. It's about 12:30, 1 o'clock right now. I forgot to check, but it's about that time. And me and Tanner, we're about to head out of here. Great morning, like I just said, landing into a lot of really nice rainbow trout, a lot of nice cut bow trout. Tan, how do you feel after that Lake Rio Blanco trip? Oh, redemption's been had. Redemption's been had. <laughs> We're going to head out of here right now. The bite slowed down dramatically. Right around 10 o'clock, things started getting really finicky. We pulled in a couple more fish, of course, but it wasn't anything like in between uh, 7 and 9.30ish. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, though. Like if you guys did, comment on the video, share with your friends and family. It's been a great time doing all this stuff for you guys. Until next time, Team Cop signing out. <laughs>